Students, friends and viewers, you are welcome to Angel Health Academy. Community Health Nursing Mnemonics. Topic of interest is Research in Community Health Nursing. Important topics are Need and Significance or Scope of Research in Community Health Nursing or Importance of Research in Community Health Nursing. Problem Areas in Community Health Nursing Research. Role and Functions of Community Health Nurse in Research. Need and Significance or Importance or Scope of Research in Community Health Nursing. The mnemonic I have been set is World Population Demand for More Research in Community to Enhance Knowledge, Practice and Skill in Primary Prevention. So let us expand. World stands for World Population. Research in Community Health Nursing can be applied for World Population of the Community. Second Population. That is pattern of health and disease, the, especially if it is an endemic area, endemic diseases. So research in community health nursing will helps to identify the different pattern of health and disease among the people. Demand stands for distribution of diseases. Research in community health nursing also helps to identify the distribution of disease among the population in the community. Four stands for factors affecting health and diseases. Research in community health nursing also helps in to identify the various factors which influence the health and disease of the community people. Another scope is more, that is multiple causation. We can identify various multiple causation of a particular problem which is prevalent in the community among the population. Research risk estimating in the community so scope of research is another area is we can identify the risk or estimate the risk among the people regarding various problems in the community in in stands for identifying clinical and subclinical cases research in community health nursing helps to identify the various uh, clinical cases uh, clear cut symptom cases moreover the subclinical cases are the carriers in the community thus we can prevent the spread of most of the communicable diseases community 2 stands for community diagnosis and treatment. Research in community health nursing also helps to make a, a mass screening that is community diagnosis and community treatment. Enhance stands for evaluating the primary health services. So research in community health nursing helps to the community health personnel to evaluate the primary health services and modify the primary health services if needed. Knowledge stands for knowledge, attitude, belief and practice of the people. So, research in community health, health nursing helps to identify the knowledge, awareness of the people, their attitude of the people, beliefs and practices, healthy practices or unhealthy practices of the people. Then practice stands for policy making. Research in community health nursing will help to make different population policies. Skill, strategy development for planning, organizing and implementing various programs in the community. Research in community health nursing also helps to develop certain action plans or strategy for the planning, organizing and implementation various national health programs and other programs in the community. IN stands for investigation and appropriate interventions. So research in community health nursing also helps, helps in to uh, make various investigations in the community and related or appropriate interventions in the community. Then primary stands for public health laws. So scope of research in community health nursing also will help us to uh, promote various public health laws, new public health laws to implement or amend new public health laws based on the identified problems, various problems. So last one is prevention. Prevention means uh, research in community health nursing also will helps to identify the preventive problems then based on that we can prepare a number of um, uh, preventive measures and uh, control measures thus we can prevent and control a lot of problems in the community. So you can use this diagram to explain in detail. The second session is problem areas in community health nursing research. So the research in community health nursing mainly focus in two areas one is related to population and another one is related to community health nursing workforce or personnel. The mnemonic I have been set here pack up hepatitis B positive boy. So the most important area we can conduct a research in community health nursing are P 
പി സ്റ്റാൻഡ്സ് ഫോർ പ്രൈമറി ഹെൽത്ത് കെയർ നീഡ്സ് പ്രൈമറി ഹെൽത്ത് കെയർ നീഡ്സ് ഓഫ് ദ പീപ്പിൾ എ സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ അവൈലബിലിറ്റി ആൻഡ് ആക്സസിബിലിറ്റി ഓഫ് പ്രൈമറി ഹെൽത്ത് കെയർ ടു ദ പബ്ലിക് സി സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ കമ്മ്യൂണിറ്റി ഇൻവോൾവ്മെന്റ് ഓർ പാർട്ടിസിപ്പേഷൻ എക്സ്റ്റെൻഡ് ആൻഡ് നാച്ചുറൽ ഓഫ് പാർട്ടിസിപ്പേഷൻ കെ സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ നോളജ് ഹെൽത്ത് ആറ്റിറ്റ്യൂഡ് ആൻഡ് പെർസെപ്ഷൻ ഓഫ് ദ കമ്മ്യൂണിറ്റി പീപ്പിൾ യു സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ യൂട്ടിലൈസേഷൻ ഓഫ് ഹെൽത്ത് സർവീസസ് ഹൗ മച്ച് ദ ആർ യൂട്ടിലൈസിംഗ് ദ ഹെൽത്ത് സർവീസസ് പി സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ പ്രൊമോട്ടീവ് ബിഹേവിയേഴ്സ് ഓഫ് പീപ്പിൾ ഹെൽത്ത് പ്രൊമോട്ടീവ് ബിഹേവിയർസ് ഓഫ് ദ പീപ്പിൾ ക്യാൻ ബി ഐഡന്റിഫൈഡ് ത്രൂ റിസർച്ച് ബട്ട് ഇറ്റ് സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ ഹെൽത്ത് പേഴ്സണൽ റിഗാർഡിംഗ് ഹെൽത്ത് പേഴ്സണൽ ദയർ ആഡിക്വസി ആൻഡ് ദയർ എഫിഷ്യൻസി B stands for Barriers in Availing Health Services. If there is any barriers in availing health services by the public, that could be identified through research. Then positive stands for Preventive Problems and Measures. Last, boy stands for Barriers to Community Involvement. If there is any barriers to involve in for the community program or participation by the community people could be identified by conducting a research in this area. So, these are the important problem areas where we can apply the research. You can use the, this diagram to explain in detail. Last part of the topic is role and functions of community health nurse in research. I have been set a synonym mnemonic here, PACK UP. P-A-A-C-K-U-P. So, functions of a community health nurse in research, that is, first one is problem selection. Second A stands for assist researchers in getting the samples. Third one is assist in collecting data. Fourth one is collaboration with other health related uh, sectors researchers. Fifth one is knowledgeable consumer. Act as a knowledgeable consumer. And sixth one is up to date or information. So first one, she has to find out various significant problems. Then she has to conduct the research. Then second one, she has to assist the other researchers to getting the samples in her community then third one is assist in collecting data for the various researchers who conduct the research in her area fourth one is she should work collaboratively with others on variety of research topics in her area fifth function is a community nurse need to be knowledgeable consumer of research findings since application of research findings will improve the community nursing practice and its standards last function is update the information she should read relevant journals regularly and she should have a group discussion she should participate in seminar etc to get the current update in research and evidence based practice so thanks for watching ningalku video ishtapettu nu vicharikkunna mattoru pudhiya video mai vindu kaanunna vare stay tuned with angel health academy ningal channel idu vare subscribe cheyidallengil subscribe cheyan marakkaradu thottathulla bell icon um kodi onnu press cheyanengil njan upload cheyina ore video odana ningalku notification aayittu labikkum ningal sirumaayi kaanunna oru viewer aanengil share cheyanum like cheyanum marakkaradu see you bye bye and take care